All right, this video is for Andrew Corvo. He's commenting on my last response video to someone saying that a vacuum stuck behind the nozzle of a balloon car makes it not work, which proves that rocket thrust doesn't work on Newton's third, which I knew it would work in the first place. And not that this is the greatest experiment to really prove that anyway. It's kind of neat that the air is rushing super fast in the vacuum and not coming out so fast the car and it'll still go forward because of Newton's third. But here's the car now. He complained that the nozzle was pointing down at the floor. So now, now I made a big spacer thing to make the nozzle point straight back. The balloon would rub on the ground which is why it was pointed down before so I put sticks to hold it up and I'll show you it works and then I'll show you with the vacuum. And you can see that there's nothing in the end of the vacuum, maybe. You will... Let me get a flashlight for you. Yeah, sure. <sighs> nothing in the end of the vacuum, so I'm not... Catching it on anything. The empty vacuum. You can see all the way down there. There's not gonna be any cuts in this video, so you know I'm not messing with anything. Let's get something so you know the vacuum can suck. And here we go. I'll show you the balloon car working on its own, and then you'll see it work with the vacuum behind it. So you know it works. And then I'll do first of you will be from over there with the vacuum and then I'll put it on the side so you can see that's actually in there. Got the vacuum on. you got now what's your problem pointing straight back it's not blowing against anything except super fast rushing air in the vacuum which is for sure going fast in the air coming out here i mean come on it's like a slight breeze if someone was kind of blowing in your face yeah yeah all right see what you got